Hi, I'm Andrew. Today I would like to teach you how to find the line structure for 2-methylbutane. So the first thing is we're going to focus on the parent name, and that's the butane. Now there's two parts to every parent. There's going to be a prefix, the but, and the suffix, the ane. We have to know what those represent. I have a nice little table here to help us out. All right. Uh, by the way, check out in the description below. I'm going to leave you all the assets here. Okay. So but represents four carbons. That's the prefix. Okay. And the ane represents an alkane. And basically all an alkane is is just a whole bunch of carbons single bonded together. So in other words, you got four carbons single bonded together. All right. Don't know why that keeps turning into a box, but what are you going to do? So what I now want to do is draw that out. Okay. Now every dot on this paper will represent an atom. And in this case, it'll represent a carbon atom. Okay. So go to a dot. Let's pick this one right here. And I'm going to just put a single dot right there. That's going to be my number one. Okay. Then what I want to do is go to the next dot. Now you can go either to the left and up, to the right and up, or down. I don't care. But I'm going to go this way. All right. So now that I went to the next dot, that's carbon number two. Then I go to the next dot that represents carbon number three. And then the next dot there represents carbon number four. So in other words, one, two, three, and four, I drew out my parent name butane. Okay. Now, moving on to the next part, we have this two methyl piece. Now I know that's a substituent because of the ol ending, the ol. Don't you love saying that ol? The ol ending. Um, and it not only is it a substituent, but now the meth tells me how many carbons there are. According to this table, the prefix meth represents one carbon. So this is telling me that I have a one carbon substituent and the two tells me the location on the parent. The numbers in this formula will always tell you the location on the parent. So what you gotta do, go to carbon number two on the parent and add one carbon on it. So you're gonna go straight up, connect the dots, you're gonna go to the next dot. You don't even have to put the dot there, but, and that would be it, all right? And guess what? Two methylbutane. Thanks so much for watching. I hope that was nice and easy. And you know what else is easy? Liking and subscribing, maybe even telling your classmates. All right, to help us out, to help us help you. All right, help, 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 help. We'll see you later. Bye.